welcome back to another one of my videos. If you haven't already, please subscribe and click that notification button to stay out there on all further videos because trust me, it is a lot. What we have for today, we have some more of the pasta I have for my grandmother. And then on the side, we also have some uh, Texas toast I accidentally burnt a little bit on the back. But it still tastes pretty good, so, you know, it'll be fine. And then over here, we have some um, Skittle flavor uh, sugar-free juice packet. I don't, I don't know what you call it and stuff. I'm pretty sure I'll write it down below. But uh, yeah, that's what we have for today. Um, so for today, I'm just going to go into what happened from the last video. Um, some of the mistakes I went through for the one before that also. Um, and then I'm also going to talk about the game that I'm playing today, which is um, BitLife. That's what I'm playing today. Um, and I think that should be it for today's video. And of course, the review of what I'm eating today. So let's get into it. As always, tastes really good. Mm. I wonder what it tastes like on the, it's called the garlic toast. Mm. Mm. Mm, it's it's not bad. I put this in the microwave for about um three minutes and stuff because I put it in for two minutes and it was like kind of soggy in the middle so I added an extra minute and then this happened so one thing to keep in mind for next time is to put it in for like two and a half minutes and stuff so I won't like over burn or over you know you know what I mean Mm. Yeah, it just reminds me of like a crouton and stuff, which isn't bad and stuff. Next time I really gotta remember what to do for two and a half minutes. Like I said, it's not bad, the flavor still tastes good, but it's just a little too hard. Yeah, I definitely need some water after that. That was fun. Or not water, juice. Oh my gosh, I need juice. Yeah, so anyway, I said before that I was playing BitLife. Obviously, it's been over here for a while. Um, I have had experience playing BitLife since I first got my phone. Not this one, my like first phone ever. Um, and that was about two years ago I started playing BitLife. Um, they went through some updates, it was obviously good. And then between, uh, I say May and like early July, I kind of, there was a period I stopped playing it and stuff because like it was taking up a lot of space. I had to like 
get space for other stuff and I just like got rid of it. So then I got it again um today to play and it was really actually cool and stuff. Like um I really like the new update like they have a new update on here like where you can be like a princess or a lord in like certain countries and stuff. I really like it especially since like um you can be there and you can be like the heir to the throne or like you can like you know force your way up to the heir of the throne if you know what I mean or you know um you know it's really cool and stuff and they also have like a thing where you could like they have like special traits and stuff like um what's it called like special traits where you could be like uh you know a criminal or something you could have like criminal skills or like something like that um I really like playing it and stuff I usually like bit life and stuff but I like the new update that came with um also they have like another update where you can like um be in like the NBA or another like sports league and stuff which I found enjoyable. I think one of the, um, I played this several times throughout the day. But one of the lives that I did have, it was like, um, I was like part of like the soccer league, league in Spain and stuff. And I did that for like 20 years of my life before like quitting and stuff. And it was actually pretty fun. I mean, I'm not a sports person, but it was something I still enjoyed and stuff. It's just really fun doing like being new people inside like a simulation like this. And plus you could get away with a lot more, which is fun. Not that I would ever do it in real life, of course, but you know. So I would say that game is definitely fun and you should definitely try it and stuff. I will say though that if you don't have like a lot of space on your phone, you should be ready to clear some for it because it's a pretty large game. But um, you know, it's pretty fun and stuff. I think it's pretty good. Um, if you don't do it without the ads, um, because there's a thing where like um you need um you have if you want to get rid of the ads in the game you have to like pay uh money to get rid of it of course but it's usually i think it's like 2.99 um i did it when i first got the game and stuff so then um, i did it on my old phone and then i went to my new phone and stuff i already had the purchase i still remembered it and i just transferred it over and it was all fine and stuff so you know it's not bad So yeah, I wanted to go into the um into last uh the last video I posted and stuff. So with that video, um <laughs> it was pretty late and um I was gonna do it earlier and stuff, but I think as I said in the video, like the application wasn't open then, so I wasn't able to do it. So then I tried to um do the application for the special BTS event um later that night, thinking that like it would be i thought it was 13 day 13 hours before like in korean time so i thought it would be like oh if it was like 12 or not 12 or like 11 at night here it'd be like i don't know it's like 10 a.m in like korea or something um so i thought I'd, i thought i'd like have time to like sign up but it's actually ahead of our time so it's really in actuality um the next day for them so today when i'm doing this it's what tuesday so it would be wednesday for them so i didn't ca i didn't take that into that into account at all um and that's one of the biggest issues and stuff with um doing stuff like bts or really anything that's like overseas like taking account of like the time zone and everything that's really difficult i mean um i have gotten better at it but that was something i actually completely forgot about so yeah, I won't be able to do the event and stuff, which is, I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty sad. But on the positive note, I mean, from what I saw on TikTok, at least a lot of people 
aren't able to do it. So at least I'll find comfort in that and a small group of people who aren't able to go and can just, you know, be sad about it. They're even talking about having like their own Zoom, which is everyone in ARMY just talking about it. And um, just talking about um, how we're not able to go because we're all broke and stuff. And yeah, it's not that I'm like broke or anything. I don't think you're going to have to pay anything for it. But it's just that I don't have a passport either. So, and that's another good thing. Because if I had done the application and then I needed a passport and I couldn't do it, I might have been like blacklisted from all the events. So at least, you know, that's something. I always gotta look at the bright side of things like that. So, you know, I can't complain. Um, also, I wanted to talk about some of the um, mistakes I had with the video prior to that with the cat spa and the uh, WordPress video. I know that was really weird and stuff because the first mistake I made was that I didn't include the gameplay in the video at all. So then um, I deleted that and then I'm reposting it tomorrow at like 8.30 p.m. So it should be there and like good. But then another thing I forgot is that, I mean, I talked about Caspa, but I didn't talk about WordPress that much because originally it wasn't really the focus of the video. I really wanted to focus on Caspa, but I didn't expect it to be a bust. Like Animal Restaurant was good. I think it was made by the same company as Animal Restaurant. So I thought it would be good, but it was just kind of boring and stuff. Even though it was the same function, I just found it really boring. So then that was kind of a letdown. And then add to the fact I was just really like mentally like, tired and stuff for like no reason so then um I kind of focused more on like eating and you know basically just the one liner about cat spell and that was basically it but um I could talk a little bit about WordPress now um I thought WordPress was good um it's I think I said before it's like really like good for like challenging your mind and stuff um you know it's really it's pretty chill game and stuff otherwise I really liked it and stuff but um one of the next games I want to look at, um, because I'm still vetting episodes, I'm pretty sure I might not be able to do that for a while, or ever, I'm not sure, because some of the games I don't like, or some of the stories I don't like and stuff, I have like a particular like, you know, but um, there are other story interactive games I am looking at that I'm really interested in, so I will get back to you with that later, but um, the next video I, I do, I probably want to do, um, What's it called? What's that game called? I just said it. Uh, no, I didn't. No, I remember what it is. It's Genshin Impact and stuff. I don't know if a lot of you guys heard of it and stuff, but I've seen it a lot in like ads on YouTube and stuff, and it looks really fun. Um, it looks like my type of game, so um, I'm actually downloading it as we speak on my phone. So I'm probably gonna like do the gameplay um, after I download um, this on YouTube and stuff, and I'm probably gonna check it out and see what good it is and stuff. Hopefully it's fun. It looks fun, but of course it looks can be deceiving. The graphics look good. The graphics look really good. It kind of reminds me of like Dragon Raja. I played Dragon Raja actually. I would do one on Dragon Raja, but um, there was a lot of glitching as you get further down in the story. And then plus the storyline kind of doesn't make sense going through it at least for me i mean coming after coming from like you know games like ace attorney and fire emblem like you know i like rpgs or like games in general because they have to have like a good storyline to them that's you know something to motivate me to keep playing and stuff and see how it ends and stuff so um you know i would play dragon raja but it was just like it was just so confusing and the fighting was just a little confusing um at least going deeper into the story after you like you know once you play it you'll understand what i mean comment down below if you play dragon Raja or any like rpg games or anything That was good. Now 
That was really good. Yeah, I'd have to get in, again, I'd probably give the um, pasta a 10. It tastes the same, tasted wonderful. Of course, it was made by a quality chef, so I wouldn't expect anything less. Um, garlic bread, I would give an 8. It was pretty good in flavor, two points, because it was burnt and hard and, and tasted like a big crouton and stuff. But, you know, again, it was on me, so what can I say? For this, I'll give it a 10, too, because this tastes really good. I say this is really good, um, especially when uh, drinking after the garlic bread and stuff. So, plus it has no sugar in it; it's sugar free, so it tastes really good. So there I was thinking that everything tasted fine and the video was going to end well, and then I drink that last bit of the juice, and oh my gosh! It hit me. Oh. Mm. oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Mm. I just got hit by a sour. I was drinking it. And it just got sour. I was drinking it. It was like sweet, sweet, sour, a little sour, getting more sour, and then bam, it's acidity. Oh my god. There's still some over, but I'm so, I'm afraid to drink it. This is orange flavored too. I didn't expect that. First started like orange, then it came down to a lemon or something. Oh. And usually I like how that that was a surprise. I'm gonna drink the rest. Wish wish me luck. Mm. Burns burn my tongue a little. I did not expect that, and after giving it such a wonderful review, <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Just for that, I'm gonna give it. Oh my god, it's so good! It's so good. I'm gonna. I'm gonna give it a nine. Yeah, I'm giving that a nine. It was doing so well. And then that hat. Oh, it's still in the back of my throat. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. It was I like sourness, but it just came too fast. I was not expecting it. it. Took me by surprise. But anyways, that is it for today's video. If you like this video, please subscribe and click that notification button to stay updated on all future videos because it's a lot. Um my next video, as I said, I'm looking into uh, Genshin Impact and stuff. Um, let's see. And also my next video, I'll be talking more about my music because I have some interesting news because I've been doing some stuff. So, um, yeah, I'm going to keep you updated on that stuff. But um, I hope you guys have a great day, a great life. Oh, my gosh, it's still in my throat. The taste is still in my throat. Oh, my gosh, I need to get some water after this. Stay fun, stay cool, stay yummy, and stay safe, and stay away from... I won't say stay away from this, just be careful with this. I, I'll, I'll link it down below or write something, but oh, my gosh, that was a surprise. Now, go have some fun. Oh, my gosh, it's still a mama.